The international network of consecrated life against trafficking in persons, better known as Talitha Kum, has celebrated its 10th anniversary with a moving exhibition entitled Nuns Healing Hearts. It was the Pope himself who inaugurated this exhibition, composed of images taken by international humanitarian photographer Lisa Christine. It is a culmination of more than a year and a half's work, bringing her to more than six countries. I think the thing that has touched me most about this is just working intimately with the nuns and seeing how tenderly they walk forward, but with so much strength. And uh, they tirelessly help people. And they have so little resource, so they're able to do so much with um, just their presence and, and, and their active help. Gabriele Botani, coordinator of the Talitha Kum Network, also participated in the journey throughout Italy, the Philippines, Thailand, Guatemala, the United States and Mexico. We're used to carrying out our projects without much publicity, and I must say agreeing to these photos was a little bit complicated at first. This culture of exploitation for profit turns people into objects, merely to be used, abused and ultimately abandoned. You could say thrown away. In any case, what you find is still the destruction of life in all its depth. The project was made possible through the collaboration of the Vatican's Galileo Foundation. Its president explains why it is so important to support such a cause. Here are sisters doing what we all wish we could do in real life. If we had the time, or the heart, or the courage. We don't. We're too human. But they do it for us. They do it in place of us. And so the very least we can do is to give them a little bit of money that will go directly to the work on the ground of the sisters. The exhibition, which has already been blessed by the Pope, will be open to the public until July the 10th. It is situated just a few meters from the Vatican, in the headquarters of the International Union of Superiors General. The Talitha Kum International Network currently has 2,000 nuns collaborating in 76 countries in five continents.